Hussein, formerly RCC for Kampala City, has been appointed RDC for Yumbe District. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing even. But uh, this guy, Hudu Hussein, uh, formerly RCC for Kampala City, has been appointed RDC for Yumbe District. And uh, some people are saying that uh, he was becoming a small god right here in Kampala. He, he was becoming a problem in Kampala, I'm telling you. Anyway, this guy has been replaced by Amina Lukanga Nanziri as the new RCC. CC for Kampala. Very beautiful woman right there. And of course right here on the Buzz UG, I congratulate her so big time. By the way, this is the guy who recently threatened to chase away the preachers on the streets of Kampala in the name of uh, clearing the city. And everybody was like, you guy, you're joking with God. Hey, hey, you're joking with God. And I think he's the same person who chased away the hawkers on the streets of Kampala. I remember the likes of uh, Mr. Mosh and other Kampala castlers were reminded Demanded to Chitalia after trying to put resistance about uh, you know the whole issue of uh, chasing hawkers on the streets of Kampala, and I think he's the same guy who ordered for their arrest. But uh, surprisingly, right now he's been taken somewhere far away from Kampala, that is in Yumbe district. And by the way, those people in Yumbe they are not easy. Hey, those people, uh, when you bring your nurses, they work on you seriously. But yeah, Hudu Sain has been transferred to Yumbe district, and uh, right here on the Buzz UG, I wish him all the best. In other news, Buganda Road Court has issued an arrest warrant against novelist Kakwenza Rukirabashaija for absconding. Now, the sureties have been summoned to appear on 11th April to explain Kakwenza's whereabouts or they will have to pay 10 million shillings in case he jumps bail. And we all know that Kakwenza is in Germany right now. And as I speak right now, Kakwenza has responded to court through his social media platforms. He actually says court should send his passport so that he can attend court sessions or they take it to Uganda Museum. <laughs> ah, this guy is funny. But in other news, a police officer identified as Simon has been knocked dead by a driver who was reportedly attending a Zoom meeting. Can you imagine? You're driving and at the same time you're attending a Zoom meeting. Some people are just very unserious with their lives. I mean, how do you drive while in a meeting? Definitely, there will not be any concentration. And uh, this incident happened at Ginger Road near Uganda Management Institute, commonly known as UMI. And uh, Afande Asan Kasinja says this police officer, Simon, was returning back home from work before he met his death. May his soul rest in peace. That is the latest I have on the Buzz UG. In case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and uh, don't forget to tap on the bell for all the notifications. Thank you.